Hey guys, Sergeant Pug here. Today I'm going to be showing you my two centerpieces of my Warhammer army. On the left we have the um, Chaos Imperial Knight, and on the right we have the Great Brass Scorpion. Um, the Imperial Knight, which I'll just bring closer, is um, entirely magnetised. You can take pretty much everything off. Like so, um, and quite a lot of it's poseable, like this bit here, like the gauntlet, and the thumb is also mobile. Build that back. So it's pretty large too. About as tall as my hand. See that? And you can take off the helmets. I have other helmets for it as well. Go grab them. We also have other weapons and stuff for it, like this, like this chainsword. Thermal cannon. And missiles. Here are the other two helmets. I have the Renegade Helmet and the Paladin Helmet. So that's the Imperial Knight done. Go on to the Great Brass Scorpion now. This is absolutely massive. Yeah. Have a good look at it. There's my hand. There, to be a bit of scale. It's incredibly heavy as well, considering what it's made from. And give you a better view all over. The only thing on this that's poseable is this single claw here which is pretty useless because when I lift it up it just flops straight back down um, it's on a nice wooden base which has also been painted and this is Ford World so it's made of resin which makes it harder to glue which is kind of annoying all these wires There you go. That is the Ford World Great Bar Scorpion. Now I'll show you them together. There you go. That's the Imperial Knight and the Great Bar Scorpion. Bye, see you guys next time.